Hey you guys, it's Peter, and welcome to my channel. Peter! <laughs> boom, 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 boom! Review stuff, and it is 30 degrees, and I am standing outside of Walmart. Look at the parking lot, it is absolutely dead. This is like the perfect time to come to Walmart, okay? Because there's never anybody here. But let me tell you why it's not the perfect time to come to Walmart, because as I was getting out of my car, I noticed that like somebody that works here was like waiting to be let in. I have to go here for one thing. I need Harry's razors, okay? Because I am out of them, and I've been out of them, so I need to get some. But there was like one person waiting to get let in, and I was like, I think they're closed. And so the guy that was letting her in, he like saw me getting out of my car, and he like leaned out, and I go, are you closed? And he goes, we're closed. <laughs> I said, okay. And I was like, oh my God, the Walmart is never closed. But let me just tell you, thankfully, there is my favorite store right across the street, The Meyer. So we're gonna go to The Meyer across the street. The only reason I had to go to Walmart anyway is because of the razors. Because they have them at Target and they have them at, um, what do you call it, at the Walmart. But they don't have them at The Meyer. I don't know why. So. Um, yes, I do put the before everything. So I was real over it. I was like, well, what am I gonna do for razors? Now I'm gonna have to come back here on Super Bowl Sunday when everybody's trying to buy their cheese balls, balls, <laughs> family friendly, and their um, pinwheels and all that kind of stuff. So I'm real over it. I'm like, ugh, now I gotta come back here tomorrow to get the razors and how am I gonna make it to my Super Bowl party in time because I have to have razors. So anyway, here I'm drinking this from yesterday. Um, so anyway, there was something I wanted to dress in here. Oh, I can't remember what it was now. But anyway, so we're going to go across the street to Meyer. I have several things to buy. <laughs> Razors and deodorant. But I'm sure I will find more. So I thought, why not just do a little bit of a Meyer haul and then show you guys a Meyer and a Walmart haul and show you guys what I bought. Now, you know I put Walmart in the title, but... <laughs> No, we didn't go to Walmart tonight. You just have to imagine, okay? Did you ever play Imagination when you were a kid? Just imagine that some of the things that I bought were from the Walmart, okay? I know it's a stretch, <laughs> but it is what it is. So anyway, and then there's the Kohl's. You can go over there and you can get use your Kohl's cash. And then right here is Jersey Mike Subs. I've never been there in my entire life. And then there was Denver CBD. You can go over there and you can get your oils and all that kind of stuff. And then there's Staples. I love Staples so much. They have like all the best office supplies. So, if you've never been to Meyer before, this is Meyer, and it basically is a superstore just like Walmart. People always ask me, like, what is Meyer? They're like, I don't know what you're talking about when you say Meyer. Are you talking about Mrs. Meyer's, like all that kind of stuff? No, I know Mrs. Meyer's is the face wash. <laughs> So many people were so upset about that the other night. They're like, I cannot believe you washed your face with uh, with hand washing stuff. Don't worry about it. Just get over it. So anyway, and um, here's my little wallet that my husband bought me. A little Gucci Gucci, <laughs> Poochie Gucci Gucci that my husband bought me for Christmas. Wasn't that so nice? Okay. So we're going to go in here, and I don't know that I'm going to show the whole shopping experience, but I'm going to go in here, and we are going to purchase some things tonight. So um, we'll see what they have. I definitely need to get deodorant. And whoo, cold. A little nipply. <laughs> okay, we're going to go out here. So this is what the Meyer looks like when you walk in. Let me show you some of my favorite things if I haven't. These are a few of my favorite things. Okay, so they don't have it, but this brand right here, Fresh Creations, has, you can see they have this Mexicali dip but they have a street corn dip that I love, but they don't have it right now. They just have dill dip, which I don't know. And then I love any of these hummuses, but my favorite is the, uh, is the, uh, they don't have my favorite either. Alex's favorite is the Supremely Spicy. My favorite is the garlic, which I can't believe they don't have. Anyway. We don't need that anyway, because I'm not here for that. I'm not here for the food. Today I'm here for um, buying. Well, we're, I'm not here for all that. So anyway, I'm gonna 
go down here and um yeah should we spin through their clothes like sometimes they have really fun clothes here oh actually you know what i've been wanting a pacers hat don't, act, don't even worry about it, why I want a Pacers hat. But there's this one Pacers hat that I want. You know what I mean, like the Indiana Pacers? But I don't see it. But see, they have all of these Pacers hats here. Is my camera out of focus? Come on, camera. They don't have any of the hats I want. But this is where I get a lot of my champion stuff. Oh, that NASA sweatshirt's kind of cute. Um... This is where I get a lot of my t-shirts. They have these t-shirts and they're always on sale. Sweat shorts are cute. Okay, but in the back, they have this champion sweatshirt or section. Oh, no, 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 they have new stuff. Oh my Lord, they have champion t-shirts. Look at all of this. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that is so cute. That is so cute. Okay. <gasps> oh my God, look at that. So, we're gonna have to see how much some of this stuff is here. <laughs> okay, this, an extra large in this black champion jacket. Let's see how much it is. It's gonna probably be way too much money. Where's the price tag? $39. How much is this hoodie? I love this hoodie. Of course it's not my size. Oh my God, it is, it's my size. $60? Holy hell's bell, $60. But can we just talk about how cute this would be on me? Oh my God, look at that. We might have to see if we can price check that and see how much it is. Now these are 45. But I have that already, I think, at home. I have that exact same hoodie. Oh, these champion hoodies are so comfy. Um, is there like one of those price check things around here? Do you know what I'm talking about where you can price check stuff and see like how much it is? I'm sure it's $60, but. Oh, there is, there's a price scan thing right over there. Ooh, here's a price scan thing right over here. There's lots of people working this late at night. I feel bad for them having to work. Okay, price scan. Move the toaster. I wanna buy a new Keurig. This is what I wanna get. Price scan, don't be 60. <gasps> 42, 42, I'm getting it, I'm getting it. So many deals, okay. <laughs> I do want to show you some of their really cute um, socks they have. Well, they don't have so many of them now, but they do have these cute socks. They don't have as many as they used to. So anyway, okay. Well, we found one thing that I didn't need, which is always the problem when I come in here. Okay. Throw this in here. Do they have sweat shorts? Their sweat shorts are so comfy. No. I don't really care for these t-shirts. Okay. They actually have not bad like women's like workout clothes too. Do you see? Woo la la. Okay. So now we're gonna go over to the cosmetic -y section because that's the stuff that I need. But we're gonna walk through the books because I wanna show you something. So, Meyer has some of the best book section, or has one of the best book sections, like better than Walmart by a landslide. Look at this, okay? They have kids books, family, young adult. Look at this, look at all those paperbacks, all this, all that. Do you see this book section? They have like one of the best book sections ever. What is Danger in the Deep? What is that? Oh my God, I've never even heard of that before. So anyway, they have all of this. Best-selling authors, right there. I think it's like a bookstore, isn't it? Cookbooks must reads. 
They have young adult here. <sighs> that book was actually really pretty good. This was like one of the worst books I've ever read and ever reviewed on my channel. Okay, more young adult books, young readers. Oh my God, look at all the hearts. And then here they have the best sellers. And then over here they have like all the books that, you know, like all the good ones that people are buying and reading and talking about right now. Then they have magazines. All that. They have discount books. $5.97. And then here are the best sellers. Poor Tyra. She's on the $5.97 section, honey. You are clear rent. Poor uh. Oh my god. Look at all these candies. Oh, I can't. It's so delicious. I'm gonna have to get some of this stuff to review for my review channel, don't you think? Oh my, this is my review channel. <laughs> and then look, bonsai trees. And then I always get my husband these little succulents. He loves the succulents. There's some more back there. Okay. So let's go. First, I want to buy. Oh, yes, ma'am. They do have the Harry's razors. <gasps> Thank God. Okay, so I'm gonna get. Oh shoot! I'm knocking everything down. You have to put things back the way that you found them. Okay. Don't you hate that when people put things where they don't belong? They knock things over. Now, I don't know about the other Harry's products, so I'm not going to buy that because I don't need all that. But, um, these are the razor cartridges I bought. They are $15.99. Right now, you can get for $9.99, you can get a razor, and then it comes with two extra blades, and or two blades, and then a razor handle. I swear by these, you guys. I love it. It's the best razor I've ever used. It's better than um, uh, Dollar Shave Club. I use the Art of Shaving shaving cream. That's the stuff that I use. Now over here is deodorant. Let me tell you a little funny story about this deodorant. So I will show you. I use um, Old Spice, but I go all the way down to the original and I get the antiperspirant and deodorant. Buy two. So I'm gonna buy two. Now let me tell you, when you were on a plane somewhere, going somewhere, it smells so good. It smells like the old school, it's the old one. We were going somewhere, and this guy in front of us, he smelled so good, and it was his wedding. He and his wife were getting a wedding, and they had like 20 people with them. And I said to him, he kept on smelling, I was like, what is the smell? So finally, I was like, I am really sorry to bother you, but like, you smell so good, what is that smell? And I remember he had like a little fedora on and stuff. And uh, he was like, oh, it's just my uh, Old Spice deodorant. So I started wearing the Old Spice deodorant after that. I want to smell this Tropics. I've never smelled this Tropics before. Oh, no, man. I don't, I also don't like these kind of deodorants. The ones that, so we'll put that away. We don't need her. Okay. What else am I going to get? Let's see. Toothpaste we have, oh, mouthwash. I need mouthwash. So, I'm gonna get this. I Oh, I, I do wanna tell you one thing. So on my vlog channel, like my tooth was like hurting. And so I said something about it on there and people recommended me get this closest which is non-irritating rinse for ultra-sensitive mouths, non-burning alcohol-free, soothes mouth sores, wounds, eliminates bad breath. It's $12.09, I got it, I swear by it, okay? But for like a nightly, um, uh, for like a nightly mouthwash, um, I'm gonna get this Listerine Nightly Reset. Oh, here it is. Where's the one that has? Is this it? Total care. This is the one at six fifty nine. I feel like I don't pay this much for it. Uh, 
Okay, this is the one that I get. It has zero alcohol in it. Fresh mint. Six and one things. Okay, then we need new shower gel. Now, I want to get another shower gel. Um, I want to get a shower gel at, like, Lush. Just bear with me for just a second. We're always trying new shower gels. So what is this? Olvina Bourbon Cedar? Let's smell this. Oh, no, 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 no. That stinks. Mountain Sage. There's all these Old Spice ones. Irish Spring, I like. But what do I want? Uh, Old Spice Hydro Wash. Do we have enough shower gel at home? Well, you guys want to see what my favorite shower gel of life is. I'll show you. It's expensive, though. I usually get it at Costco. So I'll get it at Costco, but I'll show you where it is. Where is it? Maybe it's with the soap. It's the Neutrogena wash. Oh, you know what? I just realized something that I need to get. Contact solution. Um, where is it? Optifree. I'm gonna get this one. So they can take it on me with trips because we're getting ready to go to Dallas. Okay, you can also test your eyes here. I did this when I first got my readers. And, okay, so I don't see the Neutrogena here, but I'll show you when I find it. Okay, here's more, here's more Listerine. So this is the one with, okay, shower gel. They have all kinds of shower gels over here. don't see the Neutrogena though. I also wanted to see if they had Soap and Glory here because I love those Soap and Glory products. But I will show you something that I absolutely love. They put these like plastic things in between here and you can't like put your camera anywhere. I guess they don't, they're not camera friendly. Oh, hi. <laughs> I just wanted to show you these things that I totally believe in. These are one of my favorite hydrating um, face masks for late at night. It's these Neutrogena Hydra Boost Hydrating Overnight Gel Masks. And they're like $2.49. So I'm gonna get two of these. Um, I'll take three, because I'll get them for my trip. I don't see Soap and Glory. They must not have Soap and Glory here. Um, let's see. Nope, don't see it down there. I know they have the Neutrogena face wash or the Neutrogena. Um, they are already, listen, they already have their sun care stuff out here. People are ready to go on vacation. Okay. Nope, I don't see any soap and glory. This is so fun, isn't it? I love shopping with you guys. They're so much fun. Hold on, pull this back. Do you guys want to get real depressed? Look, they're already putting out their summer stuff. I mean, I'm ready for summer, but it's Valentine's Day. Don't get it twisted. I've got a whole llama love you for you. Oh my God, somebody. Llama tell ya, this is us. Oh my God, special delivery, hugs and kisses. Kind of corny, isn't it? See, look, they have all of their summer stuff, their patio. Ooh, I like those lights. Maybe we'll do those lights this year. I'm not convinced those lights work. They don't ever really work for us. Okay. Let's see, I can't believe I'm at 20 minutes. Well, I haven't really purchased a whole lot, but I've only got one more thing that I need to get. Oh, I know what I wanted to look at. I wanted to look at these journals. Hold on a second, because they have all of these really fun journals here. Life is good. What is all this? No. Monthly planner. Or oh, I got one of those. I want to see if they had any really fun creative boot camp. If they had any fun journals.
journals. Look at all these journals. Do you like to do this stuff? Oh my God, I love to do that. Oh, look at that, it's so cool. Woo. Oh, look at that. Oh my God, it's so nice. Okay. Um, <laughs> this is what it's like going shopping with my good Judy, Tanya and I late at night. Now across the way is my favorite section and that is the candle waxes, but Peter needs to stay away from here right now. See, they have the Valentine's Day. Ooh, what is Moroccan Rose though? This is what my good Judy and I do. We come here, Tony and I, we stand here and we go like this and, ooh, that's nice, I'm getting those, okay. I'm gonna get the Moroccan Rose, which is funny because I'm not a big Rose fan. Um, Sweetheart Cupcake. These are from Tuscany Candles. Ooh, that stinks, I don't like that one. <clears throat> okay, so, uh, oh, Lavender Vanilla. Do you know this is the way you're supposed to smell a candle? That stinks, I don't like that. Okay, um, let's go on. Turbo tax, don't forget to do your taxes. Okay, I have one more thing that I have to buy. Yankee candles, I don't feel like those candles burn very well. I think it's a hype. Do you think it's a hype? Oh, I forgot I have two more things I have to get. I think it's a hype. Um, look at this, are you ready? It's my face wash, Mrs. Myers. Clean day, discover limited time scents now in bloom. Mint, lilac, and rose. Okay, which one, let's smell these. I know I'm not gonna want mint. No, ooh, oh, it's on my nose, I was right about that, okay. Um, lilac, that would make a nice face wash. Let me get that one. And rose. Ooh, that stinks, okay, that's not a good rose. So I'm gonna get the lilac. Okay. And then the last thing I need to get, I'm gonna go to the, there's an, actually a Mrs. Meyer section, but I'm gonna go, oh my God, they have weighted blankets here. I've been wanting to review a weighted blanket. Do you all think I should? Okay, let me know in the comment section below. But I'm gonna get, I need to get an air freshener for my car because, well I just do, is the reason why. And they, they say they're supposed to last 30 days, but they never last 30 days. Where's the car stuff? Have I already passed it by? If you see me walking down the street and I pass you by, walk on by. Okay, where is it? I don't see them. Oh, here they are. Which one should I get? Okay, Fresh, har fresh Harvest Pumpkin, Febreze. Um, look at all of my options here. This is a lot of options. 50% off air fresheners. Buy one, get one. Oh, buy one, get one. 50% off. Oh, Macintosh apple. Let's just do. What? Oh, spiced vanilla? Mm -hmm. Stinky, stinky. Um, new car scent? No thanks. I think I'm going to do this the Harvest Fresh pumpkin. We'll try that. I've had it before. Okay. Ooh, what's these? Refresh. Okay. Invigorating grapefruit. Who care? Revigorating Ocean Breeze. Let's do the Ocean Breeze one. Let's try this. Here's a new one. We'll try the Ocean Breeze. And we'll get rid of, I mean, it's it's time for uh, going to the ocean anyway, isn't it? Okay. Tanya. Ta oh, I forgot she's not with me. But I will tell you this. It is today my tw best Judy's 24, oh, it's gonna stop, hold on. It is my good Judy Tanya's 24th sobriety birthday today, so please everybody, that is a huge accomplishment, so please go wish her happy birthday in the comment section below, okay? Now let me show you the Mrs. Myers section. This is what I'm talking about when I talk about Mrs. Myers, okay? Look at this. They have all of this. Here, I'm gonna get my thumbnail in front of all of it. Put that out of the way. I said get out of the way. That's so cute, isn't it? Get out of the way. Somebody's walking by. <laughs> Don't even worry about it. Okay. <laughs> I know that people think it's so funny when I'm trying to get the perfect. Okay, so they have Peony. Don't say that fast. Lilac, mint, rose. And then they have all of the, they have apple. Plumberry, ooh, that sounds good. Oat blossom. 
what's the red one? Radish, that stinks, I've tried that before. Okay, geranium, basil, lemon verbena, I love that one. Reminds me of the teacher from Aloha Sun Prairie. Then they have the room sprays, the scent sachets, the candles. Then here's all the cleaning supplies. And then on the other side is the laundry detergent. So here's all like the body washes, body scrubs, all this kind of stuff. Now I've tried the body wash, the body scrub, and the lavender. I'm not real impressed with it. So I want to get it. maybe one more. Should I get a multi-surface cleaner for the... Um, I don't know what we have at home right now. So I'm going to get the lilac to match what we have because that'll smell really good. The lemon verbena smells good too, but what's the plumberry? I want to try this really quick. This would make a good face wash. <laughs> These are basically my face washes. I don't know why people were so bent out of shape about all that. <gasps> oh my God, you guys, you know what I totally forgot? The hand sanitizer. I have to get some hand sanitizer. We don't want to get one that's partially open though. Here, I'm going to get, um, they have mint. Oh, they have basil and lavender. I think I prefer to have lavender. I don't know that I want a uh, mint one, so. So, yeah. I wish it, I could show you. So, here's everything that I got. I need a good thumbnail. I wish there was somebody here to take the thumbnail for me. But they're not, so <laughs> this is what you do. <laughs> anyway, this is everything that I got. And, um... I have no idea how much it's going to be, but I'm going to go check out now, and I will come back in the car and let you guys know the total value of all the things that I bought, which I'm sure is, I don't know, $100 or something of crap that I didn't need. So anyway, thanks for going shopping with me, and I will see you in just a few. Okay, I'm back. I'm in my car. The total price of the haul was $104.73, which everything on there I needed. <laughs> except for the hoodie but i kind of needed the hoodie i mean every once in a while you have to reward yourself right and basically all i do is wear hoodies and long sleeve t-shirts but when i got in my car i'm practicing a secret and i basically have been um secreting myself rich and look what i found three dollars on the back floor so it was important that i went back there to look anyway but anyway i had a lot of fun and had a lot of fun um, I used the restroom <laughs> before I left, and when I was coming back through uh, the like the section where all of the fruits and vegetables are and stuff, they have this whole stand out now. They have a new wine, and it's called Farm Fresh Wine, but the flavors are like apple and stuff, and I'm like, is this Boone's Farm, and they've rebranded themselves? How corny! Oh my god! But my good Judy Arlena, if you never saw my videos that I did with Arlena, Arlena does like the Boone's Farm, so I'm going to have to tell her there's now a brand at Meyer called Farm Fresh, so so anyway, somebody let me know if that's the same thing as Boone's Farm and they've just rebranded themselves. Anyway, anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, let me know in the comment section below and I will do more hauls or late night shopping things. It's really funny because when I started YouTube, the idea of carrying a camera around with me in a store, even though it's the middle of the night and nobody's up, would have absolutely terrified me. So thank you for coming along for the ride. I had a really fun time. Um, yeah, so this was a shopping haul on a late Saturday night. So anyway, let me know what you think in the comment section below. I love you guys and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.